Welcome back to the show. Now, the Cleveland Metropolitan School District wants all kids to get more out of their education. And if that means making sure a child feels more comfortable and can flourish in a certain type of environment, yeah. then they make sure that opportunity is made available. For example, they offer single gender schools. Mm. In other words, got an all boys school and an all girls school. Yes, and here to discuss them with us today are four of their principals. Welcome Terrence Mitchell from Valley View Boys Leadership Academy, Derek Holyfield from Kenneth W. Clement Boys Leadership Academy, mm -hmm. Victoria King from Douglas MacArthur Girls Leadership Academy, and Crystal Wilkins from Warner Girls Leadership Academy. Welcome, Welcome principals. Welcome principals to the show. Thank you. I feel like I'm in trouble. Uh -oh. Like with me and Maria. Done and I got called out to the office again. I'm grown. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> no, we're so happy you guys are here. Now, look, we want each of you all to answer this question individually because you are all at different academies. So we're going to start with Terrence first, okay? Your schools already stand out because they're single gender. But can each of you tell us what makes your school unique or sets it apart from other schools? We firmly believe that we need to build the world that we want to live in. And that is exactly what we're doing at Valley View. Um, Valley View is a place that a young Terrence Mitchell needed. Uh, it is a place that I firmly believe that my son needs, um, which is why we bring him here each and every day. Our school is a very exciting place for young men on the west side. We actually thrive academically. Our students are doing exceptional. We have many programs, after school partners, and Saturday programs as well. We firmly believe in being very present with our young men, and which means that we spend a lot of time um, in our school from extended day to our after school programming. Uh, to weekends with tutoring um, and athletic programs. And all those things are run by myself and our teachers. And so we fully believe that with us being present, with us really being a part of our school community, that our kids can continue to thrive. We want it to be a place that um, rivals many of our suburban counterparts. And we are excited for the young men here at Valley View Boys Leadership Academy. Good morning, thank you for having me. My name is Victoria King. I'm the principal of Douglas MacArthur Girls Leadership Academy. We are a pre-K to eight school located on Cleveland's west side in the West Park neighborhood. We pull from the whole city though, including some of the neighboring suburbs. We are the MacArthur Monarchs. We are growing leaders who are competent, confident, and compassionate. We're really proud of our positive school culture. We have an amazingly creative and dedicated staff who are committed to seeing our students succeed. We have a very family feel at our building. Our students feel safe and challenged in their day-to-day -day interactions. We like to provide experiences for our girls to develop in, into the whole child. We are lucky to partner with North Point Ballet to provide ballet classes for our pre-K to two students. We also partner with American Heart Association for hands-on experiences and field trips regarding STEM opportunities for our students. We are Disney Musicals and Schools program where we provide theater experiences for our third to fifth graders. We also have yoga that comes in weekly for our girls. We have multiple leadership opportunities for our students, including being able to lead our student-led mediations, being involved in our student council, and of course, a part of one of our amazing athletic teams. We're a small little building, but we are bursting with beautiful artwork and we are looking forward to having more students join our amazing school. Thank you for the invitation to be here. I am the proud head of school of Warner Girls Leadership Academy. We are the home of the wildflowers. We have about 400 uh, little wildflowers here in our garden. Our vision is to inspire the next generation of young women to become confident, competent, and compassionate leaders who will make an impact in their community and beyond. Our mission here is to cultivate personal growth, leadership, and achievement. We have a number of partnerships that we are proud of. We are right in the heart of Slavic village but our school is an all-city draw so we have wildflowers that come from all over the city of Cleveland and its surrounding suburbs. We have partnerships with the National Coalition of Girls Schools, MyCom and Slavic Village P16, the Boys and Girls Club of Northeast Ohio, Boys Hope Girls Hope, University Settlement, America Scores, First T, Saving Our Daughters and a host of other partnerships that provide a number of opportunities for our girls here. Mm. We have a partnership with the Center for Arts Inspired Learning so that our girls have opportunities in the arts for photography and for dance as part of our after school programming. We are poised to make gains in the upcoming school year and we are just excited to be back in person and growing our school one wildflower at a time. Good morning, my name is Derek Holyfield 
and I am the principal at Kenneth W. Clement Boys Leadership Academy. Our model is building the men of tomorrow starting today. We have a blended learning curriculum with an emphasis on strategies that encourage learning for boys. We do a daily morning meeting in which we include positive affirmations, meditation, Tai Chi, and Capoeira. Mm. We have weekly leadership courses, which is led by our Dean, Mr. Ismail Douglas, and his focus is manhood, brotherhood, and respect of women. We also offer extended learning opportunities after school. So our scholars are here from 8 a.m. until 6 p.m. in our after school program. Programs in our after school program include chess, yoga, photography, financial literacy with Fifth Third Bank, nutrition, African drumming, graphic design, instrumental music, poetry, and Boy Scouts. We also have over 30 community partners, including three mental health agencies that work in our building. 40% of our teachers are males. And our goal here is to continue to inspire these young men to attend high performing high school. Again, our boys come from all over. Um, they're in every neighborhood on the east side of Cleveland and the surrounding suburbs, including Euclid, Cleveland Heights. Uh, we have a student from Willoughby and other uh, surrounding suburbs as well. And that's what makes Kenneth Clement a unique space for young men to attend and thrive. I see the differences. We have a son and I kind of want him to go to both of the schools on one school on Monday and Tuesday and the other school Wednesday, Thursday, and then Friday is a toss Take advantage of all of it. I, when he man, said so uh, meditation, positive aff affirmations, I was Yoga. like, okay, okay. But then he said Calpretta, and I was like, I ain't never had no Calpretta. I don't know what that yeah. is, but it sound good. It hey, sound like it's working. Out. <laughs> Let me tell y'all something, viewers. Now I got to scoot up on y'all. When you have schools like this in your community, Correct. it's Cleveland Metropolitan School District Absolutely. that have these academies that you can take advantage of. Mm. Set your kids apart. Set them up for success. And I'm right. saying, you'll be blessed later. Right, and you that's what these schools are doing. Yes. And you can tell that from their partnership, yep. their curriculum, and their, their principal on down to their teachers. Right. It always starts at the top. It starts at the top. Principals, thank you so thank much you. for spreading awareness, letting us know about your, your uh, academies. Yeah. I, I'm excited. I'm fired up. I want to go back. Now, look, we got some more <laughs> cribs in the CLE. Don't you go anywhere. We'll be right back.